Hey everybody, this is Barton Holmes with Yamaha Marine Center and Holmes & Owen Yacht Sales. Today we are listing this 2022 Key West 203 FS, which is, stands for Family Sportsman. So this is a boat I sold new um, not very long ago. Unfortunately, the, the owner of the boat has not really gotten any use out of it. Um, it's got 33 hours on the motor, so we still have lots of warranty on the motor. Uh, the warranty on the boat itself is up. Uh, the boat is uh, just over a year old. Uh, has the Yamaha 150. It's a mechanically controlled motor, but the Yamaha 150 uh, stainless steel propeller. Let's just go through some of the options on the boat. Um, trim tabs, which you can see there. Uh, that's the transducer for the sounder. It's got a Garmin sounder. The trailer is a Wesco tandem axle trailer. Um, with torsion axles, no leaf springs, and disc brakes on both wheels, alloy wheels. Uh, up top here, we've got, let me see if I can show this to you, we've got the factory T-top with rocket launcher back here, life jacket storage, little electronics box. There's nothing in the electronics box, it's empty. No VHF radio on this boat. Um, at the helm, we've got the 943 Touch, full touch screen GPS, chart plotter, fish finder, sounder. So we got the sounder on there also. You can see the hours 33.3. Clarion stereo, trim tab controls. Uh, this has hydraulic steering with the tilt steering wheel. It's got a little option here to uh, hold a cell phone. He had us install these pile. Uh, external speakers. There are four speakers down below for the stereo, two in the bow, two in the stern, and then we've got these overhead speakers. Uh, the leaning post here, upgraded leaning post because this has the folding armrests, so this is an upgraded version with the uh, flip down bolsters. This boat also has uh, the step uh, storage unit here. This opens up for storage underneath there. A place to put cell phones and all up top, and then the bench across the stern. And in the center is a live well underneath here. Uh, this boat also has the um, cooler option, the pull out cooler option. You just pull it in, the igloo cooler pulls out, locks back in place. Uh, this boat also has raw water wash down, and up front you'll see fresh water wash down up there, so it's got both sources. Um, of course, self-bailing cockpit, all the water drains out through the scuppers here. Um, there is a float, interesting, there is a float um, inside that scupper so that water doesn't backflow through the scupper. Uh, the little float pops up and it uh, seals it from water from coming back up and does a good job. Uh, some rock, uh, some uh, rod storage underneath the gunnels here. Uh, I've got four rod holders, two on each side. More rocket launchers on the back side of the leaning post. Uh, uh, we also have uh, lights, floodlights, for the cockpit two in the stern. A couple of lights here, different colors. Light up in the bow here. And then in the bow, um, the seat on the front of the console opens up and you've got storage underneath there. We have these, um, the, seat, the bow seating option which gives you the removable, removable backrests and these uh, snap-in cushions, and then underneath those are storage lockers. These just pull up, and you've got lockers in there. We've got fenders aboard the boat, dock lines aboard the boat, anchor aboard the boat, life jackets, flares, horn, everything you need to go boating. Uh, very nice boat. Um, quite a bit of a savings over ordering uh, or getting a 2024 version of this boat, and it's really the exact same boat. You know, it's a uh, I think a great product, very nice running boat, uh, it'd be available at a very attractive price. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. We'd be delighted to speak with you about the boat. Thanks so much for watching.